Hey everybody, Jody Osafsky, Jordan Real Estate. Thanks for coming back to my video blog. Today we're going to talk about curb appeal and a couple simple things that you can do that will make a huge difference to buyers driving by and coming to visit your home. Welcome back. So a few things we want to cover real quick. If you want a free home equity report, just click the link right over there. And if you're interested in searching the entire MLS, all the homes available in our market today, click the link right over there. So today we're going to talk about staging your home and curb appeal. First impressions are lasting. We've all heard that our whole life. Our grandma, our mother, everyone has told us that. Same thing goes for your home. When that buyer pulls up, if they're just driving by before they even call, you need to have that first impression just wow them. So there's a couple simple things you can do. Obviously, keeping the lawn mowed and green is huge. Flower beds free of weeds definitely can pay to just put some bark or some kind of um, gravel or something in those flower beds to keep it very fresh looking. Clear away all the cobwebs from any doorways or windows. Get any um, dead leaves, if it's fall time, away from the walkways and the doorway, as well as a fresh coat of paint on that front door can make a huge, huge difference. We don't want to pull up and see any um, half hanging off um, screens, anything like that. So these kind of repairs, cleaning shutters, those things can make a huge difference. Some flower pots on the front porch also is a nice touch. So then we go inside. And as far as staging goes, staging is crucial right now. 92% of all buyers start their home search online. And um, as I have mentioned previously, we're dealing with a lot of first time home buyers, they're watching a lot of those HGTV type reality shows and they expect perfection. So if you can give them beautiful pictures online and present the home beautifully and then when they come through, it isn't a night and day difference, you will have them see past a lot of imperfections on your home and ultimately you'll get a higher offer. Sometimes we're seeing as much as one to 5% more um, offer wise for a staged home versus an unstaged home. So if you're looking in the price point of a $250,000 home, that could mean up to $15,000 more. So a few things you can do is obviously declutter your closets, your countertops, kitchens and bathrooms are huge. They want to feel spacious. So clear off those countertops, put the bare necessities on, start to box things up, act like you're already moving. Box things up, put them in a storage room. Uh, be organized about it, but definitely um, live on what you absolutely need. We all could use a little uh, spring cleaning from time to time. So take advantage of that time to declutter, clear out closets, like I said, keep things vacuumed and neat, no dirty dishes in the sink, preferably not even the dishwasher running for the showing. That seems like you um, panicked and got things going at the last minute for them. And there are a few extra touches that I can add um, when we sit down and talk about putting your home on the market. Please keep in mind that when you use my services and hire Jody to help you sell your home, that you get a free professional home stager to come through the home and give you a consultation. We will go through it room by room with them and make sure that the pictures and representations are perfect to get you top dollar and as fast as possible. Thanks so much for listening today, you guys. I have a lot more information I can share with you. If you want to discuss this further, if you know someone that's thinking of selling, I'd love to just sit down with them. You can always reach me at support at alwayscalljody.com or 801-598-7091. Thanks for tuning in.